In our health cast today, we're going to take a look at a condition that can affect about 15% of all adult men. It's called varicocele, and though it's not dangerous, it, in a lot of cases it can be very, very painful and significantly impact male fertility. Fortunately, there are several treatment options out there. Daniel Alvarez never gave much thought to his health until he began to have pain in his pelvis. It was very uncomfortable. So like, sometimes you wake up in the morning, it was like, sometimes painful and it was really uncomfortable. Dr. Jason Wolf, a urologist with HCA Florida Kendall Hospital, diagnosed Daniel with varicocele, which is an enlargement of the veins in the skin that holds the testicles. It's a dilated vesicle that is uh, very stretched out with poor uh, valves the same way that someone with a varicose vein in their leg would have. Dr. Jonathan Black with the Center for Gynecological Oncology says women can also suffer from a similar condition. It's called pelvic congestion syndrome. There are veins that drain the gynecological organs, the uterus, the cervix, the ovaries and fallopian tubes. And if the veins in the pelvis are not working properly or the valves are malfunctioning, then the blood gets backed up in them causing ultimately varicose veins within the pelvis. While some cases of varicose seal resolve on their own, there are times when surgery is needed. Some are more traditional type of surgery where we make an incision and excise the large vein segment to improve their flow of blood to the testicles. After undergoing treatment with Dr. Wolf, Daniel no longer has pain and his fertility problems are in the past. Oh, I feel nice. <laughs> I feel a whole lot different. I feel better. I can do all my stuff normal. I can have babies again. That was a very nice experience for him. And you should also know about 20% of adolescent males do have varicocele, which can have a significant impact on testicular growth and function. These young patients are typically tracked, though, with regular doctor visits just to monitor the effects and also to avoid irreversible issues. Now a video that shows police officers in Michigan doing everything they can to defuse a volatile situation. A teenager in crisis holding a gun to his own head. I'm 17. You're 17? Okay, what are we doing here today? Hey, 